Building websites on the Go High Level Builder doesn't have to suck. In fact, you can build beautiful custom website layouts in mere minutes. Don't believe me? I'm gonna show you how in just a moment. But before I do that, I got a question for you. How many times have you found yourself staring at this? That blank builder, wondering what to do, where to start, how to make it look awesome so your clients keep paying you. Maybe you've worked on it for hours on end for a client build, only to think that it looks, well, mediocre. Or perhaps it's worse than that and you feel like this guy. As an agency owner that wants to scale, you gotta be able to design quickly and build quality stuff all at the same time. If you're like most people, you probably bought some templates or hired it out to save some time. But when you got it back, maybe it just didn't look very good or didn't do what you wanted it to do. Some come stacked with so much CSS, you gotta be a coder to actually edit your own template or theme. Hi, David Bustle with Agency Armory here, and we feel your pain. And that's exactly why we built an entire ridiculous library of pre-designed content that you can use that can be an absolute game changer for your agency. We call it Site Skeleton. It's a way to build beautiful websites and funnels inside the builder with zero coding. You simply drag and drop your way to a professional layout in less than five minutes. So that's a bold claim I know, and so that's why I wanna demonstrate Site Skeleton for you right now. So what I've got is I've got my uh, cell phone right here, and I've got a timer set up. I don't know if you can see that, but it is for five minutes. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this right here, and I'm gonna jump over to my other screen in just a moment. And what we're gonna do is I'm gonna actually time how long it actually takes to use Site Skeleton to build out a quality website layout. And uh, I'm gonna let you guys see it live, all right? So let's jump over to this other screen. I've got a blank builder set up here. Now normally to build a uh, website, what you would do is you would actually go in, you'd add it in a section, you know, you go in and add your columns and then you start, you know, dragging in these elements over here, right? We're not gonna mess with any of that stuff right now. What I'm gonna do is just delete that out. We're gonna start from scratch. I've got my uh, timer set up right here. And so what I'm gonna do is start it right now, bam. Okay, we got five minutes. And I'm gonna show you how quickly you can go and not have to do any of that. So first up, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into section, add section, and I'm gonna show you right here, we have my layout. And as you can see, we have a ton of elements in here already. I think there's like 200 something elements. You can actually see all of these in our library right here. They have individual pages where you can go and see what all elements are in there. Now on the builder, what I'm gonna do is just start dragging in elements. So let's start with a navigation. You know, we want to have a navigation bar where people can navigate around our site. So as you can see, I just drag, you know, dragged that element over and bam, it populates. So now all I got to do is just customize this. Now we probably want to have a hero section in here. You know, we want to have a big section to let people know uh, what the site's all about, let them know they're in the right spot. So I'm going to drag, bam, a hero image. Then we want to have a uh, welcome image. So what I'm going to do is go and add in, let's do four and five on this one. Bam. And let's add one more. Bam. So as you can see, we're starting to get, it's starting to come together here. We've got a, a navigation, a big hero image, a little welcome section, letting them know and it's starting to really come together. And so the next part, maybe we wanna add some features in, you know, maybe we're a service business or whatever, and we wanna uh, show them what kind of services we offer. So I'm gonna do is scroll down to the features section. I'm just gonna grab one of these and pop it in. And boom, now we can go through, change the icons and list out what services we have. All right, next up, let's see, let's add in maybe a video. Let's add in a video. And so there's one in the welcome section actually that I like that would fit with this. Bam, now we've got a video with a little paragraph there. Then we wanna add in some site content. So I'm gonna add that in. Let's go to content and I think it is content three and one. So bam, I just drug in some little cards letting people know uh, what they have to offer. I'm gonna do another one here. Let's add in some more content. Let's see. 
Let's do content one. Boom. There we go. So now we need, let's do a testimonial. You know, maybe you want to have some testimonials on the site. So let's do OB, how about 12? Let's just grab in a testimonial. Boom, now we've got a testimonial. Then we want maybe a call to action. So we want to get them to actually, um, you know, take some kind of action, right? So we'll add in a call to action. Bam. And lastly, we need a footer. So we'll go over here to the footer section. And bam. All right, time. All right, so here we go. We timed it out here on my phone. We still have a minute and 32 seconds left on the clock. Uh, it didn't even take us five minutes, and I was actually narrating the entire time and actually kind of showing you some of the back office on top of it. So it actually took less than that. Um, so as you can see, you know, we've got a pretty awesome system here where you can just go and drag and drop content into your funnels and websites. And what's great about these is all of them are flexible. You know, you can go through and resize things, you know, right in the builder. This is not all done with like CSS that you can't edit or mess with. This is all right in the high level builder uh, using a high level system to where it's easy to edit and easy to make changes uh, to where you can go through. So now all you got to do is just go through and start, you know, popping in your client's logos, swap out the branding, the colors, you know, change up the copy a little bit. This gets you 80% of the way there. And then what you got to do is just customize that to fit um, for your actual client. You know, how much easier would your life be with this? How much faster could you scale? How much more valuable could you, you know, your offer be if you could offer websites as a part of your SaaS? Well, Site Skeleton gives you that unfair advantage. You know, on top of this, in our library, we have like 200 something elements already, and we're already starting to add more uh, with our client work and um, other projects that we're doing. But it's got all kinds of stuff like navigation bars, feature sections. Let's just click on some of these and I'll show you. So when you click on it, you can actually see all of the elements that are there so that you can just drag and drop this stuff into your sites where it's already customized, already like that basic layout. Just fire up the builder, find the elements that you want, then just go over here and drag it in. It's that simple. So guys, I appreciate you taking a look at Site Skeleton. I hope you find it valuable. I hope you think that this is uh, super cool. I think it's awesome. I think it speeds up so much time. Uh, it allows me to build funnels and websites really, really fast for my clients. Uh, if you find it valuable, if you find it something that you want to deploy at your agency, uh, be sure to uh, reach out to me. Let me know that you're interested and uh, let me know what you think in the uh, comments below. And uh, I'm happy to answer questions or jump on demo calls and show you guys how this works live. So uh, anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I will talk to you next time. I'll see you.